Hey everybody, it's Daphne from Scrap and Crate. I finally finished another album. This is Christmas Greetings from Stamperia. I hope you guys enjoy the walkthrough. The tutorials are now up online if you guys are interested in building one of these of your own. So here's our cover. Um, I put some little chipboard stars here on the spine, which are kind of fun, and they add a little bit of dimension, and the, just a simple back. I'm probably going to go back through this album and embellish it, but I'm so late at getting it out. I just wanted to get some content out there for you guys. So this is um, 10 and a quarter by 8 and a quarter. 10 and a quarter by 8 and a quarter. So if you use the tutorial to build this, it's 10 and a half by 8 and a half. That's the only difference in size is the cover and the spine. Um, the pages are 8 by 10 so they're the same so if you want a little bit more room around your pages do eight and a half by ten if you want a little more snug which is what I chose eight and a quarter by ten and a quarter by two and a half okay here's our inside page page one I like this page we've got a card in the pocket and then we also have a large insert and this large insert is holding these flaps closed it's a large insert you got room for photos plus lots of room on the back um, this opens to the right and to the left and then it also once i put this back inside this just becomes a flap that comes up you've got a pocket here i've got two cards in here these are cut aparts from the collection pack or from the scrapbook pack. And then this also comes down. And this makes for a very large layout and also leaves our clock intact, which is always fun to do. Okay, so these are going to go right here in this pocket. This flap comes down and is all held together with a magnet. And then these two flaps are held together with the inserts. Okay, that's page one. Page two. We have a card on top, and then we have two flaps that open to the left and right. Let's scoot over just a little bit so you can see the whole layout. Okay, over here I just added this as um, just as a design element. We've got a flap here and um, a very large pocket. Right here is um, one of the circles that I cut out by hand. And then we've got this nice um, bifold insert that you can also put photos on the front and the back. Okay. okay, here is page page three. And I used this card to keep everything closed. There's magnets on the strap. This opens to the right, and then it also opens to the left and as you can see these are very large for very large photos or for a nice large border around your photos okay that's page four page five I've got a pocket here this is probably one of my favorite cards in the collection it fits nice and snug in here and then I've got a flap that opens and this flap also opens and that reveals a very deep pocket. So this pocket actually goes down underneath this edge. So this is uh, perfect for a nice large photo. I think that turned out lovely. I love that pattern. Okay, that's page five. Page six, I did a double waterfall. And I used a piece of um, burlap ribbon and two pieces of chipboard to top it off. There's a magnet behind each one of these, holding everything in place. And then we've got uh, matching waterfalls to the left and right. There we go. So because this is um, eight and a half by ten and a half, or eight and a quarter by ten and a quarter, um, you can use larger scale photos. You know, you can get your five by sevens in here if you want without having to spread it across two pages. This is a nice deep pocket with another large, nice large insert. There's actually enough uh, paper left to cover the back side of this. Um, I think I have five, four or five uh, 12 by 12s that I haven't cut through. And then this is just another large photo layout with a gatefold. Okay, that's it for this album. And this is Stamperia. Christmas greetings.
I'll see you guys soon.